And German Chancellor Olaf Scholz said on Wednesday there was no sense in a military solution to the Ukraine conflict and he hoped instead that a solution could be found in talks between Russia and Ukraine. He was speaking at a joint news conference with Canadian Prime Minister Justin Trudeau. Scholz said Germany needed to diversify raw materials used by industry and that his country was working with Canada on this. Germany will certainly not send warplanes to Ukraine, Scholz pointed out. This was after the United States rejected an offer by Poland to transfer its Russian-made MIG-29 jets to a U.S. base in Germany. Trudeau promised an additional $50 million worth of equipment to be sent to Ukraine soon. Canada and Germany stand together against Putin's invasion. He represents a threat to democracy, to security, and to peace in Europe and around the world. This morning I spoke with President Zelensky and highlighted once again the strength and determination of the Ukrainian people and uh, told him that Canada will soon be sending highly specialized equipment to them and invited him to address Parliament in Canada uh, and uh, he accepted. Today, I can announce an additional $50 million uh, worth of uh, equipment that we will be sending towards uh, Ukraine to help out. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.